Hey, what's up guys? It's Nelson here with Gadjax, and today I'm going to show you how to easily share music directly from your keyboard on iOS 8. The application we're going to be using is called Audio Shots. The first thing you'll need to do is you'll need to go to Settings, go to General, go to Keyboard, go to Keyboards, and from Add New Keyboard, add Audio Shot Keyboard. Go in and allow full access, and from there you'll be able to use a keyboard. Once you go back into the application, you'll want to sign in with Spotify. That way you'll have all the music that you've been listening to recently available in the keyboard. So let's open it up and try it out. So this is what the keyboard would look like. It'll look sort of similar to the stock iOS keyboard except for the colors. And you'll also notice a music icon to the left of the space bar. So if you tap on it, you can see some of the music that you've recently played on Spotify if you logged in with your Spotify account. If you don't log in with Spotify, you can also share music through iTunes and a couple of other music services. Uh, down here you have several icons. With this icon, you can go back to your regular iOS keyboard. Uh, with this one, you can go back to the Audio Shot keyboard. You can also search for music. So if you tap on that, I can just type in Kanye all day then type in return, and there I have two options to pick from. If I want to send a song, all I have to do is tap it, and there you can see it, and then I can just send it. If I want to send a cover image, I can hold down for a few seconds, and it'll paste the picture as well as the link. Okay, so now you can see that I sent it. If you tap on the link, it'll take you to Safari and open up this. You can play the song directly from your browser, or you can tap on play song in Spotify, and it'll play the song in Spotify. Alright, well that's it. Thanks guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and check out the full tutorial over at Gadgehex. Alright, thanks guys.